This tutorial is going to show you how to add places in your custom maps using My Maps. So what you want to do is you want to open up the custom map that you want to add your favorite places to. I'm creating a map about my town and my favorite place in my town. So I'm going to type in, uh, make sure I'm on that map, and because uh, I'm looking at the title on the left, and I'm going to type in the location of my town. So as I start to type it, I see that it starts to show up right away. And I'll just push return in that search bar. It's going to take me all the way to the town. And it will drop a green marker. And that's just because it's located that town or that location. I'm going to zoom in pretty far so that I can um, get uh, to exactly where I want to put my marker. Now I'm pretty familiar with my town. I want to put the marker on Main Street and I'm going to put it right in this location here. So I'm ready to drop my marker. I zoomed in using these, uh, the plus and the minus on the right side bottom uh, corner, and now I'm ready to drop my marker. I um, will come up here to the tools under that search bar, and if I hover long enough, you'll see it says add marker. I'm going to click on that, and you'll see that my cursor has changed. It's not a hand anymore, it's now a plus sign. So I'm going to add my marker right here. I know that's the location I would like it. That's a special spot in our town. And a box pops up that I can now populate. And I'm going to name this location. And I can type in anything I want about this location. Maybe why it's my favorite place or a little history about it. Um, So this is one of my favorite places in town because it has uh, a sign over the street that says Pleasanton. I could go on and write more. I could have written it in a Google document and copied and pasted in here as well. Now I want to add some images here to make it a little bit more um, exciting. So if I click on this camera, I can add an image or a video. It's going to pop up a box and it will give me a Google um, image search. So I'm going to search for that Pleasanton sign. And if I type in Pleasanton sign, what do you know? It shows up. Now it may take you a few searches to find exactly what you're looking for. Um, oh, I'm going to take this one right here. But when you find it, go ahead and click on it. You'll see it's selected. The blue check is there and the blue box is around it. And then in the bottom left, you can click Select. And I will add this now to my place marker here. Um, I love that when someone comes to this map and they can click on this place marker, this is what they're going to see. Now if I want to add a video or another image, I can click right here on this plus sign, right where that box is, and I can um, then it gives me the option back into this choose an image or a video. Now I'm in image search right now, but let's say I want to video search. Or if I created a video about my downtown and I uploaded it to YouTube, I could take the URL to the video and I could just add that URL right here. But I'm going to search for a video. I know of a good one on here. It is under, just if I search by Pleasanton. Uh, you know what, I think it was under Pleasanton, California if I search, it'd be easier to find. There it is, Downtown Pleasanton, California. It is a little video that kind of takes you through downtown. I can select that video. Again, you see the blue box around it and click select. And now you can see I have two of two items in this marker box. And if I can push play, I can play the video right in this location. Now I'm still in edit mode right now, so I want to be sure to save my work. Click save. And there we have it. If I close this out and I zoom out just a little bit to see that marker. And now I can click on that red marker. And up will pop my image and you can see the arrow to the right I can click on it and there's the video so you can put as much as you want in there to um, enhance that now you can also change your icon if you want so it's selected right now I can hover over here you can see this is where it's at that's the one I did that was the name I can change the color of it and let's say I want to make it um, I can do yellow and I can also change the icon shape, so I can choose any one of these shapes. Maybe I want mine to be a star. I can also click on more icons, 
and switch to something that you know represents um, what that location is. I'm going to stick to the star for right now, but there are lots of options for you to choose from. And when you're done, you can just close out that by closing the X. And if I close this out, now you can see my location is marked with a star. And that's all it takes to add great locations to your map.